finally got a bullhead. Had to actually come to shore to do it. I don't know why I couldn't get them in the boat or something, but good size one. I'll make a bullhead video here in a couple, uh, maybe tomorrow or something. Probably 10 inches, but just fat. Bullhead number three. It's bigger. I'll uh, make a video tomorrow or whatever. Anyways, uh, freaking things are just fat. Hammering. Let's get ready to get laid on now. It's like 4 o'clock in the morning. So. Peace. Well, there's the first bullhead tonight. I'm going to keep a stringer full. Uh, it's probably 2 o'clock in the morning. I got out here maybe an hour ago. Missed one. Let's see what happens. I'll show you guys what I got in the morning. Oh, Peace, peeps. I don't know if you guys can tell, but look at that hog. Bugs are horrible. Just casted it out. Look at the gut on him. I see my line going. Grabbed them. I'm just I'm hooking minnows through the head. They're dead. And uh, I'm grabbing it. Anyways, uh, <laughs> dead minnows. Big bullhead. Try it. Langford Lake. Wait for the walleyes to bite. Caught some nice ones out here earlier this year. Another bullhead. Big bullhead. Uh, dead minnows. Just hook them through the head. Let them lay on the bottom. Got a number four. Number two is a number four eagle claws is what I'm using. Anyways, uh, frogs are croaking. Owls are hooting. Uh, I think that's number six or seven. Caught a little tiny one earlier, about four inches long. I got minnows, big minnows. And um, that's why I don't even know how I caught that small one earlier. Really. I'll show you guys everything at the end. Maybe I'll catch bass, walleye, or pike yet once it starts getting light out. And I'll show you the release later. What a mess. smaller but he's still big one of them uh, hey I'm reeling one in and my other rod just going nuts I'm like wow I got two at the same time that surprised me anyway they're all tangled peace not sure how good you guys can see this that thing's an absolute hog bugs are horrible Yet, even worse now that it's putting light out. You know, it's starting to rain pretty hard, but like I said, I'll show you at the end what I got. I didn't expect to get any more bullheads once it got light out. Turtles are showing up. Turtles are everywhere. Right now. Little heads popping up and stuff, which is cool. Here's pike number three. Nothing big, maybe, I don't know, 24 inches or whatever. video doesn't do it any justice but anyways uh shout out to Gus at the Maplewood uh, bait shop over there in Merriweather anybody uh, local you're looking to buy your bait uh, stop in get some him and his wife mount fish and everything uh, they do a great job they get they get people sending uh, fish from all over the world and stuff United States lots of perch so all right we'll put you on the stringer Anyways, uh, I didn't think I was going to catch any more bullheads after it got laid out here, after that pike. Missed a few fish, but what else happens, peeps? Later. Well, there you go, peeps. Twelve on the stringer. 
and I let uh, two go, so 14 all together. But, ouch! Ah, that hurt. Yeah, don't let them bite you. I'm gonna let them go here. Well, anyways, I'm gonna let them go. Peace.